guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. It's Celine here. Um, my battery's dying, so I'm doing this quick. It's highly requested video to do a makeup tutorial on this look. So I'm going to film one for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, I'll be doing it. And yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so here's my first attempt at doing a voiceover with a real mic and doing a makeup tutorial. So we are starting off with primer, which is the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. And we're going to put that all over the face. My skin looks so bad this close and my eyelids are so veiny. Make sure to get that all over your face. It'll feel very sticky. And we're going to put another primer on top of that, which is the Tatcha The Silk Canvas Protective Primer. This one we are not putting all over the face, just in certain areas that need it. So next we are going to put foundation on. We use the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in Praline and Golden. We mix the two together. Make sure to use your beauty blender and blend it in everywhere. And don't forget to go down the neck. Never forget the neck. And then we are using the Anastasia Mink Stick Foundation in Contour to carve out the cheekbones as well as the jawline and the temples. We are going to continue to use that Anastasia Stick Foundation to contour the nose. We want the nose to look like we are not breathing as Paulina says. And then we are going to blend out the contour we did on the cheeks. As well as the nose with our beauty blender. Next, we are going to add some concealer. This one is the Too Faced Born This Way Concealer in Golden Bridge, adding it to the bridge of the nose, under the eyes, a little bit on the chin, and a tiny bit on the forehead. And then blend that out well. And then we're using the Huda Beauty Tantour Contour and Bronzer Cream in Medium on a beauty blender and applying that over the same area we did on the cheekbones, as well as the temples, and the jawline, and the nose. And blend that all out. We are taking another concealer. It's also the Too Faced Born This Way concealer in shortbread, but we are adding it to other areas. So this one is the inner corner of the eye and the outer, and then dragging it down towards the nose. I believe this kind of gives you like the cat eye look. I might be wrong, but that's what I think. I know nothing about makeup. So if you're watching this, thank you. I'm learning as we go. And this also goes on the outer part of the nostril nose area. Not sure what that's called. And then a bit on the lower lip, outer lower lip. I also don't know what that's called. And then with your beauty blender, make sure to blend that all out. Okay. 
And then we're going to use Fenty Beauty Translucent Powder to set everything we just did, mainly under the eyes. And then we are going to use Fenty Beauty Translucent Powder to set the under eye. We don't want any creases. And then we're gonna bring it down towards the nose and kinda like everywhere else on your face with just the leftover powder. So we're going to use Sephora's Bronzer in Deep to go over the cheekbones, as well as the temples and a little bit of the jaw. And then we are going to take the Anastasia Contour Kit and contour our face. Yes, this is a lot of contour. It's a bronzy makeup tutorial. And then we are going to take the Morphe blush kit and apply the blush on top of the area we contoured. And now we're taking Anastasia Beverly Hills M Reezy Highlighter Illuminator on a fan-like brush and putting that wherever highlighting needs to be done. And now we're using Milk Blur and Set Matte Loose Setting Powder to go under where we contour to kind of make like a sharp line. I think that's why we use it, to kind of give it more definition. I might be wrong, I'm just guessing. And then you also do it to your nose where you want it to be a sharp line and a bit on the outer edge of the bottom eye. I don't know if that's the right area to call it. And then we are going to move on to eyeshadow. So we're using the Pat McGrath Labs Bronze Ambition Eye Palette. I don't really know the colors, so I'm sorry I can't give you that. But yes, we are just applying some on the lid and the crease and you know how you do eyeshadow. Just kidding, I don't know how to do eyeshadow. We're using the darkest shade to do a liner. And then we're gonna wing it out a bit. And then add some glitter to the middle of the eye, kind of. And then spread it out so we get that bronzy, glowy look on our eyes as well. And then we are going to use Urban Decay Brow Blade Waterproof Eyebrow Pencil and Ink Stain to fill in our eyebrows. And then use Benefits Precisely My Brow Pencil Ultra Fine Shape and Define and go over that. And then use the Benefits Brow Gel to hold it in place. And off camera, we applied false lashes. Just kind of completes the look. And then we're taking the Pat McGrath eyeshadow. I don't know what color and using it as a lip liner. So it makes that darker outline look on the lips. And then we're filling it in with Kylie's Matte Liquid Lipstick in Exposed and then topping it off with Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss in Fenty Glow. And we forgot to film it, but we used the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray to, um, to set all the makeup. And this is the final look. It's a very bronzy, glowy makeup look, which is perfect for the summer. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the post notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs>